Hi guy. In this video you'll see how the actors of the TV series The Andy Griffith Show have changed. You'll know their real names and age. I will show you how they looked then, and what's with them now. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe my channel. Let's go. 1. Andy Griffith as Andy Taylor Andy Samuel Griffith was an American actor, comedian, television producer, Southern gospel singer and writer whose career spanned seven decades in music and television. Known for his Southern drawl, his characters with a folksy friendly personality, as well as his gruff but friendly voice, Griffith was a Tony Award nominee for two roles. On July 3, 2012, Griffith died at his coastal home in Manteo, North Carolina, from a heart attack he had had the day before. He was 86. But I couldn't figure out how to make it funny because just doing it with a southern accent didn't seem funny. 2. Ron Howard as O.P. Taylor Ronald William Howard is an American director, producer, screenwriter, and actor. He first came to prominence as a child actor, guest starring in several television series, including an episode of The Twilight Zone. He gained national attention for playing young O.P. Taylor, and became a household name for playing Richie Cunningham in the sitcom Happy Days, a role he would play from 1974 to 1980. Howard married Cheryl Alley on June 7, 1975. You know, uh, be kind to yourself, be kind to others. A little extra today for Ron. 3. Don Knotts as Barney Fife Jesse Donald Knotts was an American actor and comedian. He is widely known for his role as Deputy Sheriff Barney Fife on The Andy Griffith Show. He also played Ralph Furley on the highly rated sitcom Three's Company. Knotts died at age 81 on February 24, 2006, at the Cedars-Sinai Medical Center in Los Angeles from pulmonary and respiratory complications of pneumonia related to lung cancer. To be as good as he was at the age of five is incredible. I couldn't believe it I saw him act. He could... 4. Frances Bavier as Aunt B. Taylor Frances Elizabeth Bavier was an American stage and television actress. Originally from New York theater, she worked in film and television from the 1950s until the 1970s. She is best known for her role of Aunt B. on The Andy Griffith Show and Mayberry RFD from 1960 to 1970. Bavier died at 7 p.m. on December 6, 1989 eight days before her 87th birthday. 5. Colin Mayle as announcer. Colin Mayle was born in Buffalo, New York, USA. He was an actor known for Summer Rental, Kentucky Fried Movie, Mission, Impossible, and The Andy Griffith Show. He died on October 23, 1996 in Seminole, Florida, USA. 6. George Lindsay as Goober Pyle. George Smith Lindsay was an American actor and stand-up comedian, best known for his role as Goober Pyle on The Andy Griffith Show, Mayberry RFD and his subsequent tenure on Hee Haw. Lindsay died on May 6, 2012, in Nashville, Tennessee, from heart failure. He was 83. 7. Howard McNear as Floyd Lawson Howard Turbell McNear was an American stage, screen, and radio character actor. McNear is best remembered as the original voice of Doc Adams in the radio version of Gunsmoke and as Floyd Lawson on The Andy Griffith Show. On January 3, 1969, McNear died at San Fernando Valley Veterans Hospital in California at the age of 63 as a result of complications from pneumonia caused by a stroke. 8. Anita Corsat as Helen Crump. Anita Louise Corsat was an American actress and writer. She is best known for playing Helen Crump on The Andy Griffith Show, Judge Cynthia Justin on Matlock, and Jane in The Blog. Corsat never married nor had children. On November 6, 1995, Corsat died of cancer in Los Angeles, California. 9. Jim Neighbors as Gomer Pyle. James Thurston Neighbors was an American actor, singer, and comedian, widely known for his signature character, Gomer Pyle. Neighbors died at his Honolulu, Hawaii, home on November 30, 2017, aged 87.